Hi everybody, welcome to Virtual Tweak. Today I will play with iOS, which is a content management system. And you can find all the links, uh, website links, and other stuff from my weblog, which is virtualtweak.com. You can send me an email. My email address is virtualtweak at gmail.com. Before I start playing with iOS, uh, let me show you two cool websites. The first one is just looks like a Mac uh, Windows desktop. The clock is in the right side and the launch bar is in the left side. I can click on the launch bar, I can choose a theme. Right now it is in default, I can choose 10. Um, I can launch any program or looks like a games over here. So I can choose a snake. The another one looks like a Mac desktop. Here it is. So, I already write down my username or you can write down anything you want. Click on login. So, it just looks like a Mac desktop. You can play with the dock. You can click on the icons. You can move the win uh, windows, open windows and you can move the icons. This website designed to look like a desktop but the problem is we can play with it but we cannot install any software or we cannot customize the look then it comes to the next version which is called iOS this is the main iOS uh, website <coughs> Before you install iOS, make sure you re read the user manual. You have to have a PHP capable web server uh, in order to install iOS. Right now, iOS is in a beta version, so you can download it and try it out yourself. You can, uh, in the main website, you can download iOS, uh, look at some of the screenshot, stuff like that. I already installed iOS, so let's look at it. the main login page for iOS when you install iOS uh, you have to mention your username and password it is now asking for my username and password so I'm going to use demo as my username and uh, demo as my password you have many languages uh, option over here you can select any language you want so I'm going to click on the right arrow to login iOS so this is the main window for iOS. These are all the tools and this is the trash icon and on the left side the small icon it is a login and logout icon for your account. Now I'm going to change the wallpaper. This is these the flowers looks like bad to me so I'm going to change it. I'm going to click on i options and uh, here is the option for me so I can change the wallpaper I'm going to click on browse I'm going to select a uh, picture I'm going to select open change wallpaper so here is my new wallpaper as you can see you can move any window anywhere you want just like a desktop you can minimize a window you can restore a window and you can close a window this is the beta, beta version and uh, it has some of the basic software right now I'm going to show you some of the tools the first one is iEdit which is a word processor <clears throat> you can write down anything you want uh, the title I'm going to write down demo and you can save any document you want you can open any document you can create any document and uh, it has some of the basic version uh, basic option right now because it is in beta version so this is iEdit works like a word processor the next one is called iCalendar here it is iCalendar you can write down any event and save it as a calendar uh, document so you can uh, open it uh, whenever you want you can click on any date and write down any event and save it 
so this is iCalendar the next one is iPhones you can uh, these are uh, all the contacts you have uh, it will show you all, all your contacts and right now I don't have any so I, I'm going to click on new contact as you can see these are the options available for you family name mobile phone number work name fax number email instant messengers even you can leave a note and then you can save this document over here the next one is I calculator as you can see the the regular calculator and uh, the I message it's supposed to works uh, work with pop 3 email account but it doesn't work right now because it is in beta version the next one is iBoard <coughs> it works like a uh, blog you can post as many as uh, messages you want and uh, if any other users log in to your iOS they will show they will see all your messages and this is iOS web browser and uh, let me as you can see it is clear and it doesn't have all the options like uh, Firefox and uh, IE I'm going to log in I'm going to browse my website which is virtual tweak it is fast and as you can see it works which is good then this is the main IE option you can change your password you can uh, have your own wallpaper and uh, the next tool is uh, the next will show you the iOS uh, operating uh, system uh, content management system version which is in beta version 0.8 and the last one is see the little plus icon that <coughs> this tool is for application management right now they have some uh, games and uh, uh, three application available to use uh, you can install any application you can uninstall any application you want I'm going to show you how to install an application I'm going to click on iHome see the instant install application icon I'm going to click that it is it is asking me to browse the application I want to install I'm going to click on browse I'm going to select an application I want to install I'm going to click open and I'm going to click on this icon now the application is already installed I can launch the application I want so this is the basic paint version as you can see it is in beta version it works and it looks just great and uh, you can log into your desktop open your documents and you can have all the options you want uh, from uh, anywhere in the world you just need a internet connection and a web browser and uh, they are going to develop it to a new stable version and they're gonna have the new release uh, 0.9 very soon with new application and uh, I really like it a lot I already installed the uh, iOS in my web server you can check it out you can play with it um, uh, you can find the username and password in my web blog which is virtual tweak uh, com if you have any question or suggestion please feel free to send me an email my email address is virtual tweak com and uh, let me know how you like my uh, video tutorials uh, do you think it is helpful and also what kind of tutorial you wanna see thanks for watching i will see you next time